Welcome to the virtual open house for the Windy Hill Road Improvements Project. We appreciate you taking the time to visit the website and view project details. During the meeting, you may pause the presentation and navigate forward or backward using your video player. Exhibits shown are available on the project website at windyhillimprovements.com. The county and the project team are also available to speak with you over the phone or through a web meeting. Contact information for questions or comments is noted at the end of this presentation. Hayes County is working to design improvements to Windy Hill Road from the Kyle City Limits to FM 2001 to provide safer and more reliable transportation options for travelers and the community. Windy Hill Road is an important roadway to Hayes County and the City of Kyle as it is one of the main connections to I-35 and the newly improved Kyle Crossing. The roadway also has many longtime residents and businesses throughout the limits and new homes are being built every day. Improvements include widening the roadway to add a center turn lane, shoulders, and space for mailboxes, constructing intersection improvements at Dacey Lane, Shadow Creek Boulevard, Palomino Road, and Matthias Lane, adding a turn lane on FM 2001 to Windy Hill Road, building a new bridge to replace the low water crossing at Andrews Branch Crossing, and constructing culvert upgrades and drainage improvements. Hayes County continues to make road safety a top priority as we have experienced significant increases in population and traffic over recent years. <music> 2045 traffic models also show that the significant growth in population will cause several roadways throughout the county to become heavily congested with considerable delays. The county is planning for future capacity improvements to Windy Hill Road from the Kyle City Limits to FM 2001, as growth projections and traffic models suggest this will be necessary. The current plan allows for the future expansion as the need arises and funding becomes available. The City of Kyle is also planning to begin construction in the spring on Windy Hill Road from Cherrywood Drive to Purple Martin Drive. For more information on this project, please visit the city's website at cityofkyle.com. The existing roadway configuration includes one 11 foot lane in each direction, two foot shoulders and drainage ditches. Without improvements, travelers and residents can expect to see much more congestion during morning and afternoon rush hours by next year. By 2042, Palomino Road and Matthias Lane at Windy Hill Road would experience the same absence of mobility, making it difficult for travelers to easily get to where they need to go. The county plans to implement improvements in two phases. To address current congestion issues and safety needs, the first phase would be a short-term or interim roadway configuration to include a new 14-foot center turn lane five-foot shoulders on both sides of the roadway, and drainage improvements. Here, we will show you a bit more detail on each of the intersection improvements. As part of a separate project, the county is planning improvements to Dacey Lane from BB Road to Windy Hill Road. Some of the improvements for Dacey Lane are reflected here, which include the roadway widening and realignment and the new signal at Windy Hill Road. The Dacey Lane Improvements Project is expected to go to construction this spring. As part of the Windy Hill Road Improvements Project, the county plans to add dedicated left and right turn lanes from east and westbound Windy Hill Road onto Dacey Lane. The county also plans to add a dedicated left turn lane and a shared through right turn lane from north and southbound Dacey Lane onto Windy Hill Road. At Shadow Creek Boulevard, the county plans to add a dedicated left and right turn lane from east and westbound Windy Hill Road to Shadow Creek Boulevard. These intersection improvements will help with traffic flow by giving motorists dedicated turn lanes and allow through traffic to bypass them. 
Here at Windy Hill and Spanish Trails, you can see a dedicated right turn lane is planned from Windy Hill Road to Spanish Trails. A dedicated right turn lane is also planned from Windy Hill Road to Palomino Road and a right turn lane from Palomino Road to Windy Hill Road. A dedicated left and shared through right lane is planned from Matthias Lane to Windy Hill Road. These intersection improvements will help to decrease wait times at the intersections by allowing right turning traffic to bypass the queue for left turning traffic. The full project schematic is available for viewing or download on the meeting webpage, windyhillimprovements.com. The second phase would be the ultimate roadway configuration and include two 11-foot lanes in each direction, a 14-foot center turn lane, and four-foot shoulders on both sides of the roadway. Additional intersection improvements would also be included. The ultimate roadway configuration would reduce congestion and increase mobility to a stable flow with minimal delays for morning and afternoon rush hours at all four intersections. In designing the project, the team focused on limiting impacts to property owners by reducing the need for additional right-of-way where possible. Hayes County and the project team are working with property owners and anticipate acquiring all the right-of-way needed to accommodate both the interim three-lane configuration and the future expansion. The second phase of improvements, or the ultimate roadway configuration, would be constructed in the next 10 to 20 years as growth continues and funding is available. The project engineers have collected and analyzed technical data and developed the schematic. We are holding this meeting to share details with you and listen to your input. Public comments will be used in conjunction with additional technical evaluations to refine the plans as needed and finalize design. Hayes County is currently coordinating with affected property owners where additional right-of-way is needed and working with local utility companies to plan for utility relocations. There is no funding identified for right-of-way acquisition or construction at this time. Once the design plans are complete, Hayes County will further explore funding options. The information shared in this virtual open house will continue to be available on the meeting webpage. We are interested in hearing your feedback on the proposed project plans at any time, but to be included in the official record of the open house, they must be received by Friday, April 9th. Comments can be submitted by mail, email, phone, or text. Additionally, the project team is scheduling phone or web appointments on Wednesday, March 31st for anyone interested in discussing the project. To schedule an appointment or speak with a team member, please email us at info at windyhillimprovements.com or give us a call at 512-400-4297. Working with the community is important to Hayes County and the project team. Thank you for taking the time to watch this video and share your input.